the total five games to go in the season. How do you assess how it's gone so far? Um, I think I think at the beginning, since since it's come in, it's been been a roller coaster a bit. Um, but I think now that we've got the two games on the bounce, I think the confidence is really really high in the in the camp at the moment. Um, you know, we've got five cup finals to go, as they say. Um, but. I think, yeah, even after today's training session, I think there's a lot more smiles around the camp and, um, you know, we're free flowing. So I, I think we, we should be okay. I think we should be okay. I'm working under the new manager, Alan Hinshelwood. What's that been like for you? It's been good. Um, you know, he wants the team to play. Um, you know, I kind of get a little bit of a free roll where I can kind of move up top. So it is, it is, it is good to play on them. Um, but yeah, no, no, it's been, it's been, it's been okay. I think it's been okay. The last two, especially the last two games, it's been a real positive. Uh, we just have to keep building on it, and um, I just keep ourselves in the league. As you say, the last two games, back-to-back -back wins. It's clear the impact that it's had on it, isn't it, since it's come in? Yeah, hundred um, percent. Like I said, he really wants us to, really wants us to play. You know, be confident, have no fear on the ball. So I think that's what's really helping the boys at the moment. Is that. You know, we've got nothing to lose now, so, um, I mean, there's, there's, there's a lot of points to play for and I think, you know, we've got a lot of good players at the team. It's obviously been a disappointing season for us, but I think from now we can build, we can build on to, to what we can become better. What's the move been like in the dressing room? Um, it's, it's been good. I mean, we've, be, we've beaten the last two top five teams, so, um, you know, it, it, it's... It's been, it's been very good, it's been very good. Even in training, it's been good. So, like I said, now the morale's a bit better around the camp and stuff like that. I think, you know, we can we can continue to build on what we have at the moment and uh, hopefully we can continue this to the end of the season. And you've had a goal drought yourself for quite a while. How much does it mean to you to get that goal and to get back on the score sheet? Uh, no, goals always breed confidence. Um, I think we all know, I, you know, I haven't scored in quite a while, um, but getting that one, I think will kind of help help me personally with my confidence and um, with the way I play. Um, strikers always breed off goals, goals and assists, so um, I think, yeah, no, hopefully I can continue to the end of the season and uh, keep them coming. Um, just talk us through that strike on Saturday because you don't seem like that, do you? No, no, the, um, I think, like I said, it was just, it was just off instant. Um, when it dropped and I just looked up for a second and I see the keeper off his line and I just, you know, I just went for it, so. No, I'm really happy winning. Probably the one of the best goals I scored. So yeah, no, I'm really happy. And you've got Chesterfield up next, what, the first of the final five games. What better way to test yourself against the champions? Yeah, I haven't, I haven't actually played Chesterfield this season. I was injured in the first one, so it would be nice. I know they've um, won the league already, but you know it would be nice to play against them. And it's probably the best time to play them in it when they've got nothing really to play for. Yeah, got everything to play for. Exactly, exactly.